I uh, have, I am pro I'm basically a home trained cook. I learned to cook when I was a child from my grandmother who used to take care of us every day. And one Sunday, I turned on the television, or Saturday, I turned on the television in 1963, I think it was, and there was this tall, gawky woman on television, <laughs> and it was their first television show, cooking show, and we all know who that was, Julie mm -hmm. Child. And I was hooked, and I learned how to cook. I watched almost every single one of her episodes. I, ha I have her books, and I also learned uh, to cook with Jacques Pepin every mm -hmm. Saturday. So those, I consider myself to be uh, a, a classically trained home school cook. I developed this recipe actually for people who were uh, uh, not total vegetarians, but did not eat anything but fish. Uh, so instead of using chicken, now this could be done with chicken as well. But what I'm going to do tonight is the tuna divan, but I'm making the, uh, uh, the chicken divan sauce. And I'm going to be using uh, chicken stock. If you're a vegetarian, you can use vegetable stock to make the roux and the, and the sauce. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get the noodles going here. We're just going to just egg noodles. And um, you want them to be kind of al dente. Okay? Uh, you don't want them to get too overcooked because they will get much. You've seen them on television, just take this and throw this in here. But when it comes to baking, they measure it. There's a reason for that. Baking is chemistry. Everything has a reaction to the oven. Okay. Now, you can see up here, can you see this? How no, it's bubbling? No, not that. No, it is real can. Can you see? Yeah. Okay, see how that's starting to bubble? Okay. Now, there's also called uh, beurre uh, noisette, which is nut butter. Now you can actually take this to a browning stage before you put the flour in it. It gives a really kind of a hazelnutty flavor. It's brown butter. Uh, some people find it a little bit too, uh, too strong. Okay, now I'm ready to add four cups of either vegetable broth or chicken. 